I'm Tom Blundell. I'm a professor emeritus in University of Cambridge in biochemistry, but I'm really a, a multidisciplinary scientist who started in physics and chemistry, influenced by Dorothy Hodgkin in the 60s, working on insulin, and then finding my way uh, from Oxford via Sussex and London to Cambridge. Darwin came from a very special family, from uh, Erasmus Darwin, uh, Joshua Wedgwood. They were both people who were interested in, uh, in people. Uh, they, they were involved in the movement against slavery. Um, and this, I think, had a big impact on Darwin. Um, it, if you read what he said about the people he met in South America or wherever he travelled, it's clear that he had an understanding and interest in people and he had an interest in travel. And if I now move from Darwin to Dorothy Hodgkin, of course Dorothy also came from a very radical background. Uh, her husband was a member of the Communist Party I don't think she ever was, but she certainly sympathised with left view. She had this amazing ability to pull people in from all over the world. Uh, she uh, travelled in China, in India uh, and elsewhere. And the lab was multicultural, multinational, multilingual, multidisciplinary. And those two aspects, uh, uh, the sort of travel, the sort of humanitarian, sort of slightly uh, um, left view that even the Darwin, especially the, the Wedgwoods had uh, in the background of Darwin. Uh, I don't think I was directly influenced in that by either of them, uh, but I found a lot in common uh, because my major interest has been doing science on an international level I've spent my life travelling, I've lived all over the world. My research team uh, a couple of years ago could speak 37 languages uh, and um, I've been very much influenced by uh, political thought. You know, I was a, a councillor, a Labour councillor in Oxford. I, I was interested in changing things. I found it a little bit more difficult these days to balance politics and sort of social responsibility in science, but I've tried to continue it.